Hello and welcome back to the channel and today you join me for this week's Forza Fun Guide once again called Up to Speed which wants you to own and drive the 2001 Acura Integra Type R to complete all the challenges with. So this is a car in question, again it seems to be glitched in the image, my windows and lights are blacked out, I don't know if that's happening to anyone else but it seems to have been happening for the past couple of weeks. Anywho, the car itself is only 25,000 credits, so it's dirt cheap. Um, I have created a tune, it's called Forza Thumb, share code is 3360223328. Hopefully this should help you out with a couple of the challenges. Definitely not the first one though, the first challenge literally wants you to take a photo of your car. So hit up on the D-pad and then hit the right bumper to take a Horizon promo quick shot and that will be the first challenge complete, super super easy to do. Now the next one here, again really easy, just wants you to win a street race. Now in order to do this, I went over to the Costa Rocosa street race, where I have a specific blueprint created for you guys to use. It's called Forza Don Easy, and the share code is on your screen there. This is literally just a normal sprint race with no AI driver tiles, so you're guaranteed to win every single time. But you only have to complete it once, and it should take you no more than 2.5 minutes, 2 minutes 45 or thereabouts. Now for the final challenge here which wants you to earn a slingshot skill. Now for those of you who don't know, a slingshot is a drafting skill followed by a pass skill or an overtake if you will. Now to do this you need to be in a race obviously with AI driver tars. So I just went for the Junas Blanca sprint at the top of the map but you can go with any. I'd recommend one that's actually got a corner or a turn near the beginning. Now as you can see here, the race has just started and I'm trailing that Peugeot 205 in front and I'm getting the drafting skill and there you can see I get the overtake skill straight after and the slingshot skill follows. Now if you hit the car while you're getting the drafting skill and then overtake, it will not count, you won't get the slingshot skill because obviously you've at that point made contact with the car in front so it doesn't count. So here again, approaching the corner, even though I hit the corner I still got the slingshot skill, but that's one of the better places to do it if you're drafting behind a car, they'll then break for the corner and you can just go flying past them and you'll get the slingshot now i'm letting the foot play on here because i actually get two more slingshot skills in a second again like i said the corners are probably the best place to do it when the car in front starts breaking as you're getting a drafting skill you can then fly right past them and you'll get the slingshot skill and you only have to get one of them as well so as you just saw on both those two corners there i unlock the slingshot skill following a drafting and an overtake so it's actually quite simple but like i said probably the beginning of the race is one of the easiest parts to get it. just make sure you go on one that's got a fair few bends um, otherwise it might take too long for your overtake skill to come after the drafting skill and actually it won't count as a slingshot um, but anyway folks i hope this guy did help you out of course if you're struggling with anything please do let me know down below in the comments i'm more than happy to help you guys out if the video did help hitting that like button massively helps me out and also if you're new to the channel subscribing is a massive massive help as well but apart from that folks i want to wish you all the best make sure you stay safe and take care.